Hello and welcome to this video. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to connect your XNES account to MetaTrader 5 and straight away, let's get started. So the first thing that you need to do is to make sure that you have an account with XNES. If you do not have an account, you just have to download the app from uh, Google Play Store or App Store and then install the app and create an account. So let me quickly show you how the app looks like. So you just need to go to Google Play Store, all right? Um, so you search for XNES Broker, and this is the app right here. So I have it installed, so I don't have to download it again. So if you don't have the app, you can download and install it, and then create an account, all right? So once you do that, uh, you open the app, then you're required to log in, so let me log into my account. Okay, so this is uh, the account. So these are different accounts that I have created just for demonstration of this video. Okay, uh, so, <clears throat> but when you create your account, so this is how it looks like. So this is a brand new account. So uh, as you can see, it says no active account. So I did that so that I can be able to show you how to create an account from scratch because I already have another account that I use uh, for trading. So all you just need to do is to click on the plus button right there. So you're going to select the type of account. So there's a real account and a demo account, but both of them, you just create them in a similar way. So first, let me show you how to do it with a demo account. So you click on demo account. When you click uh, on demo account, as you can see here, there are three types of uh, actually four types of accounts. We have the standard account, which is the recommended one, then the pro account, the row spread, and the zero spread. So we go with the standard account. So just click on continue. All right, then uh, you can change you can change uh, the currency, but I'm gonna retain it to USD, and then the leverage. I'm just gonna retain it as two hundred, but you can change if you want. All right, then you just click on continue then you need to create a trading password, all right? So let me just quickly do that. Okay. All right, so, <clears throat> so once you create the trading password, then it's gonna redirect you to this page. So your account is ready. So all is left now all that is left is to link or to connect uh, this account to MetaTrader 5. So to do that, you're going to click on the three bar icon there, written details. Then you go to settings. And then down there, um, <clears throat> you can see there is a login and the server. Okay, the login and server. So what we're going to do, we're going to copy the login and then we shall paste it to MetaTrader 5. So the, uh, the server, as you can see there, it says XNES MT5 Trial 9. Okay, so we, uh, I'm going to show you where we're going to use that. So we need to go to MetaTrader 5. So just click on MetaTrader 5. So while you're here on MetaTrader 5, you need to click on the three bar, I the three bar icon on the top left corner. Then click on Manage Account. Then click on the plus button at the top. Then you search for XNES. Okay. Xness. All right. So depending on your location, there are different um, brokers here. All of them are Xness, but they are specific for uh, each location. So I'm in Kenya, so I'm gonna select Xness Ke. All right. So that's gonna be different depending on your location. So I'm gonna paste the login that I copied. Then for the password, I'm going to use the trading password that I created, all right? So let me just quickly do that. Okay. All right, then the server, as you can see, it's Xness. Uh, if you want to confirm, you can go back there, uh, here. So the server was Xness MT5 trial nine. Xness MT5 trial 9. So I need to change that. Xness MT5 trial 9. Oh, 
okay it was already selected there okay so I just need to click on log in so let's see um, all right there we go so you can see the account has been added here so with that now you can be able to uh, place trades uh, you can be able to analyze the charts all right you can add currency pairs okay so these are the currency pairs you can add them uh, you can uh, you can analyze the charts and learn with the demo account and then you can follow the same steps that we've done for a real account all right so let me know on the comment section whether you have any questions and i'll be willing to respond to each one each one of them so thank you for watching and see you in the next video goodbye